So um, after driving around for a while with the new AC springs, my driver's side driver axle broke. And uh, here are the tools you need to remove your drive axle. You need a plier like this and remove this black cap. And then you can remove the lock ring, okay? And then you need to remove six 12, mil 12 millimeter bolts that attach the uh, drive axle to the front differential. And uh, normally, if your drive axle is functioning, uh, when you're removing the, uh, the drive axle bolts and you don't have an impact wrench, you can lock the, the drive axle by placing a screwdriver here into the brake rotor, keeps it from spinning. But if your drive axle is broken, you need to lock the, the drive axle from spinning while you're removing the bolts. So you can use a, a breaker bar like this and have it um, push against a part of the, the body and loosen five bolts but don't remove them and then for the last bolt you can use the uh, screwdriver ply or pry bar and place it in between the bolts and pry it against the body of the some part of the the body of the car to keep it from rotating and then you can uh, remove the last bolt loosen the last bolt so this is in case you don't have power impact tools and you only have hand tools so after you remove the six bolts and the lock ring, you need to uh, remove the two bolts here, remove the tie rod end. Maybe this is optional, but I removed it anyways. And uh, maneuver the drive axle out and then you can hammer out the the drive axle from the spindle and it'll pop back toward the this way.